We've learned how to make a base 3 machine. We put in a bunch of dots and then do a bunch of explosions and we end up with a special code. But what if we have a code and we want to get back to the number of dots we put into the machine? That's what we're going to talk about in this video. Hey guys, Paul Fish here and Aaliyah. And today we're going to be working on working backwards in base 3. Let's get right into this. So when you have three dots in the one box, they go to one in the box next to it. So there, and then you take those two away. Now let's do an example. So there are nine dots right here, and we're gonna use the three to one rule to, to put it into its base three code. So for these three, we put one here and take those out. And for these three, we put one in here and take those up. And for these three, we put one in here and take these out. And now that there are three here, we put one in this box and take those two out. And that's, the, so the code for nine is one zero zero. So, so we start with the one and then goes that number multiplied by the base, which is three. And so three multiplied the base multiplied by the base is nine, and nine multiplied by the base is twenty-seven, and twenty-seven multiplied by the base is eighty-one. So there's only one dot in this box, so that means there's only one nine. Um, and so there are no threes and no zero and no ones. So that would be nine plus zero plus zero, which is nine, which is the number that we started with in this box. Using the three to one rule, we take three, put one, and take away two. And now in the three box, we have one, two, three, four, five. And so we can take three, put one in that box, and take these two away, which leaves us with one, two, zero. So one, nine, two threes, and no ones. So nine plus three plus three, which would be nine plus six, which is 15, which is the number we started with in the box. Okay. We're the funny, funny time! <laughs> That's a random money for ya. All right, so that's all we have time for. 